Jamie, well done. You've had a few cracks at Q School now for the past few years since you last fell off tour. But how do you feel you played this time round? I played shocking, to be honest. All comp, but I just, you know, queuing was gone. I just sort of grinded it out. I just visual. I've been visualising this interview for about a year, and uh, doing it. And uh, oh, I did say uh, when I'm on it, I'll say thanks to Goodwood Floors, Dominico Barrett. He needs to uh, flick a few quid in now. Uh, and Barrett's Sports and Leisure, uh, mum and dad, uh, Barry Stark, who's gave me a bit of help with my queuing. All the lads at the club, Kyron, uh, Kyron, Harvey, Rory, Biagio, big backer of mine. But yeah, just uh, over the moon, to be honest. Lots, lots happened in the last four or five years, basically at a party. And then I decided about a year ago, I'd say, probably a year ago, i would get my head down, go in all the comps that I can and try and get back to used to winning. Um, so I've done that, started to pick up a few comps and yeah, it just came together, getting my nut down, so over the moon. Yeah, yeah the, the, the pressure seems immense out there and... Well, it was when I went, went, in, went in off the blue on the last red, <laughs> off three, three cushions and it's clipped the blue, half ball and gone in off. I thought, oh no, here we go, it's a four, four three, but... Does Q score kind of get any easier the more times you play in it, or no, is it just no? It's horrific. It's just, the pressure's weird because it's uh, there's more pressure in this than playing like proper matches on the tour because you know I'm thinking oh, I've done all this work I don't want to come back next week you know and then you have to get rid of that negative thought it's oh, it's just murder but I just try to play the right shots you know and not take silly ones on but. It was hard because he was playing very negative, so I, I sort of mixed it. I went for a few just to, just to go for a few and get them open. And uh, luckily, you know, he, he wasn't firing, but yeah, just one of them. Yeah. And you've been playing for quite a long time. Um, too, you, long. <laughs> too long. <laughs> do you feel like this time you have a bit more belief that you'll be able to make it on the Pro Tour? Yeah, I mean, I've I've been working a bit with Barry Stark. I've got, I've still got a long way to go with the queuing, but I've straight, but I won't go into it. But uh, yeah, I feel like I've improved. Probably a better player now than when I was on the tour. Practice harder. Um, you know, don't go out as much. Um, so yeah, I've, you know, just got to give it a good crack this time. So let's see what happens. And last time I heard you were in the tiling business, and is that something you're gonna? Kind of oh, no, look to no, give up at the moment. Struggling, the, the knees are gone, completely gone. Yeah, you know, I've had an up on one, need an up on the other, so I struggled to do a day on the tiles. But I do, I do a bit of roofing with my mate um, Nalo. He's he's got a company called MDL Roofing. So if I need if I need a few days, I'll go and do a bit with him. But um, yeah, well, hopefully, just keep playing in tournaments and uh, practice full time. So that's the plan. And any specific goals for this season coming? Up? You don't want to know what I'm thinking. No, I ain't thought about it. I've got. I'll, I'll write out some new goals, and uh, um, I forgot to mention Chris Henry. I, I went to see him at the start of last year. A lot. Yeah, you know, I was using a lot of um, stuff that he told me. Visual, you know, uh, visualization and whatnot. So you know, thanks to Chris as well. But um, yeah, I'll, I'll sit down and write some new goals and see where it takes me. But just keep working hard. I suppose that's the main thing. And any plans for now before the season for properly now, starts? Now I'm going to have a few beers. I've, I've stayed, off the, stayed off the beers for a while, so uh, yeah, I think I'm going to have a few beers tonight, to be fair. I'm sure they'll taste absolutely splendid. Oh, they will taste Enjoy. smooth as silk, yeah. <laughs> well done, mate. All right, cheers. Thanks.